in in this video I'm going to talk about blocks and regions in Drupal. This links in with the taxonomy thing and is a another Drupal video. Now the I'm going to a bit right up front that there's so many things to cover with Drupal that I could I I could do literally thousands of videos on this and not be done. But I really really love Drupal and doing these videos is helping me learn so and my focus is now on web development so I promise I won't do more than a, a hundred videos on this but it might get that extreme because there's just so much I want to cover I might be over exaggerating but we'll have to wait and see what happens if you don't want Drupal videos then send me some questions and I, I can't promise I won't do Drupal videos, but I will do your questions in between them. Okay, so today I'm going to talk about blocks. And you can get to that by going to administer, site building and blocks. What blocks are is a way to arrange your website. So at the moment I've got, in the right sidebar I've got my navigation let's say I wanted to um, move something to the right sidebar so in the right sidebar I wanted to see the recent blog post I could just drag it up to the region which says right sidebar click save blocks and it, sh it shows the recent blog post so there, there we are. Uh, um. So, I. Uh, this is basically blocks and regions. All these things labelled are regions, and the little boxes are blocks. In your theme dot info file in Drupal six, you can now have custom regions. But I'll go through that when I show you how to make a custom theme from scratch but I, I just wanted to show you blocks really quick video but you need to understand that before you um, move on to the next video where we're going to be cre creating a, a list of categories in, in our sidebar thank you for watching and I hope this video has helped you